Hello. In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform regression analysis with both numerical data and categorical data. Our problem here is uh, we want to figure out if the starting salary has linear uh, relationship with both GPA and major. Uh, GPA is numerical data, uh, major is categorical data. So the first step, uh, we need to convert the categorical data into a numerical data, zero or one. Uh, in Excel, uh, we can use if formula to get a job done a uh, very quick type if left parenthesis uh, let's check this shell equal quotation mark business comma if the major is business mark as zero if nor or mark as one if nor zero close the parenthesis return and then we ch choose this cell and double click uh, we got the numerical data the second step we are going to run a multiple Regression, click data, tab, go to data analysis, choose regression, click OK, and here, wide range, choose salary, uh, please include header, and Input var S range, two variable, uh, include the uh, headers. And here we check uh, levels, confident interval level, uh, default 95% and output range. Uh, let's put it here and then click OK. Uh, we have all the information. Uh, let's check the major indicators. The adjusted R square. Uh, the closer to 1, the better. Uh, we have 0 0.53. Mm, that's OK. Significance F, the closer to zero, uh, the better, but at least less than 0 0.05 uh, pass. Oh, fail to pass, fail to pass. And then this three value, P value, the closer to zero, the better, but at least less than 0 0.05 uh, all of these three fail to pass the test so overall the regression model failed to pass the test uh, what shall we do next step we run simple regression separately uh, salary with major and then salary with GPA. Uh, I'm not going to repeat the process. Uh, I just show you the outcome. Uh, here, salary with major, uh, this adjusted R square uh, is fine. Uh, this significance F less than 0 0.05 pass.
and then p value this value uh, what is this value this is uh, exact version uh, of scientific notation uh, the equals this one uh, you can tell this value is very close to zero so uh, definitely is less than 0 0.05 plus uh, this value less than 0 0.05 plus so this regression uh, model plus the test uh, let's check this one salary with GPA oh this number is uh, is not close to one uh, but it's still be okay but this value fail to pass these two value fail to pass so we only have one uh, model pass the test salary with major uh, this is the equation We have the regression equation and starting salary uh, equals uh, this this one uh, the the this is the coefficient of intercept uh, this number uh, comes from uh, this coefficient major coefficient uh, because GPA doesn't matter, I put zero coefficient here. I just want to make things very clear in detail. Uh, having this regression equation, we can plug in the number to uh, evaluate uh, the, the, these two questions. Uh, Question one, business major with a GPA uh, 3.0. Uh, we just plug in the number and, and figure out uh, the starting salary is this amount. And question two, uh, other major with a GPA 4.0. And then plug in the number and and calculate the amount uh, is this uh, number oh I wish I have know this before I attend a college uh, now you know how to answer all the questions in the problem uh, that's all